gonna edit this part out Cause I'm opening your screen What's going on guys? Jerry here from Beer and Deadlifts and as promised I'm gonna show you guys a snack that Brenna and I uh, picked up at the grocery store. So this is a new brand of ice cream out called Halo Top and what they're advertising is a high protein ice cream uh, that's lower in calories. Um, so your traditional ice cream has about 150 to 160 calories per half a cup which is four ounces and also your average uh, run-of-the-mill ice cream has two grams of protein per serving. Halo Top on the other hand uh, comes in at around 80 calories per serving which again is a half a cup and they all have six grams of protein so basically you're getting half the calories and three times the amount of protein seems like a win in my books but I haven't tasted the ice cream yet that's the catch so I picked up four pints of this ice cream and as you can probably see on this uh, there's 320 calories on the peanut butter cup on the oatmeal cookie there's 280 calories per pint and the s'mores, there's 320 calories per pint, so if you eat the whole thing, it's only 320 calories. And for the sea salt caramel, it's 280 calories per pint. So, as you guys probably know, uh, I'm going to Mexico within the next couple months, and I'm going to be dieting down, just kind of getting a new body recomposition effect, and uh, just trying to slim off some fat for the beach in Mexico. I have my powerlifting meet in three days which I'll be competing about 175 to 177 pounds body weight. My goal for the cut is to lose a few pounds of fat, just kind of trim up a bit, and this will be one of my snacks for at night if it tastes good. So without further ado, I'm actually going to sample all four of these ice creams and let you know if they're any good. If they suck, then we'll just stomach through them and uh, move on to something else. Alright, so peanut butter cup. Let's try this bad boy out. Damn, that's actually pretty damn good. I would totally eat that. So we'll actually keep this one for sure. I mean, we're going to keep them all, but I will consume this one for sure. And let's move on to sea salt caramel. Sea salt caramel, 280 calories per pint. Let's check it out. Again, which is like vanilla with uh, some caramel flavor. I'm going to eat this one too. These are awesome. The one con to this ice cream is it's damn expensive. It's about five to six dollars a pint, which is super expensive. But, like I said, you get half the calories and three times the protein per serving. So, for like a health perspective, and if you're doing a bodybuilding type routine like I'm going to be doing soon, or if you're just losing to shed a little bit of weight or not consume as many calories, this is definitely the way to go. S'mores. Let's try this one out. So far, we're two out of two that are good. Let's uh, see what this one tastes like. Alright, here we go. Hmm. Hmm. So I don't know if you can see this. I'll have my camera woman zoom in. So as you can see, there's like little chunks of like graham cracker in it. And that provides an interesting texture. I do like it, but it's not as good as the other two. I'll still eat it though. Oatmeal cookie, 280 calories per pint. Let's check it out. I was not expecting that. There are actual oats in this ice cream. There are chunks of oats in this ice cream. I was chewing that ice cream. I was like, what is this texture? I was like, what is this like grainy type texture? There are oats in this ice cream. That's nuts. So it's good. I just wasn't expecting it. So um, if you buy the oatmeal cookie ice cream, you will get oats in it. So be prepared for that. All right. So after sampling all four ice creams, my favorite was the peanut butter cup, 
They had a really smooth flavor, really delicious. Overall, I would just eat that all day, every day. S'mores was number two. Uh, the texture on that was a little weird. I'm kind of really picky about texture. But uh, the graham cracker in it wasn't bad. It was just uh, a little different. But the other flavors in it made up for it. You got that marshmallowy, like chocolatey uh, goodness to it that really, really couldn't be beat, except for the peanut butter cup. Sea salt caramel was pretty awesome. Uh, so it was a, a vanilla with basically some caramel swirls in it. Uh, very standard, very likable. Um, that was my number three. And the one I didn't like, well, I, I liked it, but not as much as the rest, is the oatmeal cookie. Uh, the chunks of oats in it were fine, but it was just a little weird for ice cream. I wasn't expecting that at all. I was kind of expecting like an like an oat, oat like basically an oatmeal cookie flavoring without all the texture that goes along with it. So that concludes my review for the Halo Top ice cream. Um, from a diet and fitness perspective, I can definitely say that I highly recommend these ice creams as uh, they, like I said multiple times in this video, are half the calories but three times the protein. For strength athletes out there, if you're looking for a snack, these are definitely a, a much better alternative to the standard ice cream that we usually eat, um, as long with uh, any other people that are kind of minding their diet and nutrition along with their fitness program. So, if anyone out there wants to see more food type reviews or more nutritional stuff, uh, give me a comment below. And uh, if you like this video, hit the like button below and subscribe for more content as always. And I'll see you guys in that next video. Later.